can tell that foot difference. Yeah? Just in mobility? Mobility and... I feel like this boat... Glides better. You had a bigger <laughs> boat. Like, you had more boat. Like... Bless you. This is so much more reactive with a single paddle. This is so much more reactive with a single paddle. Your boat? Yes. Yeah, it was pretty much just going in circles. I hate it. Definitely have to J-stroke. Yeah, and I can't do that well. So right now I'm doing Canadian because it's just quiet. I like that. Okay, Bill Swift, this one's for you. Here's a couple of Campfire Ember cruisers and a Kuwaitan. Seats feel different, too. Maiden Voyage. Well, yeah, they're not made into it, so I wonder if that changes it a little bit. are super comfortable so dude like what were you sitting on <laughs> yeah. maybe the height of them is a little bit different maybe Paddling with one, you know, is like I'm doing this more. So Wade and 16. Cruiser 12-8. Campfire Ember. It's just, still smooth. just gliding. It's like shaved legs in a silk in silk sheets. Yeah, for just uh, cruising or you know just casually paddling, this ain't bad. It's definitely more reactive, easier to steer and navigate. Supposed to. You lied to me, Nick. right? Well, you know, Nick the weatherman. <laughs> <laughs> right. Motivational speaker. Yeah. That's pretty fucking nice. How much nicer is that? He's a high sticker. Well, I think he might have to be because of the gunnels.
Can you go longer? Did you open it up all I the did. way? I did. I opened it up to the 50. Yeah, it's about... Yeah, that's max. Yeah. Yeah, Look I would at, definitely go for the 50. I was going to say, it yeah. looks like you could use a bigger one. Yeah. Yeah, because I feel like I got my arms high. Yes. Yeah, your eyes sticking. You're going pretty... And you're not getting the paddles all the way in the water when you do that. Right, so I got to go up higher. Yeah. But I can move it around. I feel like I'm up a lot. How's the back end? No, you're no. looking really good. You're actually pretty good. Really good. It feels like I'm out of the water. No. Not any more than you were in the back with Sarah. Really? Yep. Honestly, it's super low. Yep. It is pretty fucking level. a wind wanting the double. Yeah. Do you feel that in your boat? It's you farting. No. Yeah, look at you. I mean, honestly, you're like cruising too. It's like I'm going like fast. You are. <laughs> look at how fast these new shoes are. No. It's a heron. With the padding on these seats, you don't feel that. Yeah, I bet you if I really push this thing out. Yeah, you're fucking moving. Try one of hers. Try this panel. Just what do you what do you got? It's all it only goes to two forty five. Two forty five. But there's a difference in the blades. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do it like this, right? Nope. Flip it over. Upside down. Like this? No. One eighty. There you go. But it's like this, right? Yeah. So that is a, well, we're, they're both fishing paddles, but that one actually has a hook on it. The hook, yeah. And the higher... I feel, I feel like it grabs the water the same. The higher you stick it, the more power you're getting forward. Right. But I'm just taking a bath every time. Yeah. I mean, it feels like it moves the same. Yeah, you're right. So, try this one. It's 250. Yeah, give me a paddle. <laughs> yeah, if you want to. <laughs> 
<laughs> it is. That paddle is nice. It I ain't is. gonna lie. I love it a lot. And like I got the smaller one that's a stingray, and then there's a manta ray, which has a bigger paddle. A big yeah, the manta ray's blade. paddle is about the same uh, square footage as, as mine. Right. And I think on a windy day when I'm trying to when you're forced when you're progress. trying to yeah, yeah when you're trying to fight yeah right. It's fine if you're just on a trip together and you like take it out solo. Right. Like gathering wood and getting stuck on the island. Yeah. I don't want to think about that. <laughs> that was a rough time in my life. I guess there is a lot of push in this. Like I said, that's the smaller blade. There's a larger blade that's like this size. There is? Yeah. That's the stingray. The manta ray is a bigger blade. It's it's a blade more like this. Wider. It's yes. wider like this one, but it's shaped. It's like the same shape, but it's a bigger It's blade. got more uh, cubic inches or whatever. Right, right. And honestly, if you're... I mean, if you get it to the size that you want, like the 260 or yeah. whatever the hell it is... Yeah. Let me try that one. <laughs> That's why I wanted you to try them all. No, I... Believe me, I appreciate it. You're a lot closer. Yes. Yeah, You're farther in the water. Yes. Like the gunnels are way out of yes. the forward. Yeah. Yes, you're sitting about in the boat where he is, yes. but we are closer to the water than you are. I remember my first time. <laughs> and I can't even use this. I can't even work it. <laughs> Was that lightning? difficult because I don't want to go because you're still trying it. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, this one just feels like I just can go. Because but you're I, pushing I, more I water. You're pushing more water. Yeah, so the manta ray might work for you. I like this better because it's smaller for my lady fingers. That, I, I, that is, that is a smaller. Yes. Yep. So actually, try the boat. I like honestly go bring the boat. Yeah. Bring the boat up there. Try the paddle in their the pond. I, I like the surface area of this one, but I like the smaller handle. Yeah, and I definitely need a longer one. Yes. But you know, I mean, look at both the boats that we're paddling. They're pulled in. I get it. I get it. My biggest concern is the wind. I'm trying to keep the nose from pushing over like I was having a problem. Right. Um, I don't think, I mean, you know, shitty conditions exist, but you are sitting way better in this boat. Absolutely. Than when I was solo? Oh, yes. fuck yeah. The front, the, the bow was out of, out of the water when you were solo with the, the other one. Fun on Lake Danoon. My friend picked up a Q8 and 16 and we tagged along to see how it went. We bought some of our kayak paddles to test and offered suggestions, hints, and feedback. We made it out after a vicious rain and came off the lake for another vicious round.